The HDMI adapter ring itself comes as you see it here. You have the actual clamp mounted on the cable, your five adapters, you've got two sets of foam inserts, one set for really small cable, like the micro size HDMI cables, one set for average size HDMI cables up to about seven and a half millimeters in diameter. And then if you don't have any foam insert at all in the clamp, you can fit cables up to 11 millimeters in diameter, which will be the, the really big cables. We've developed a clamp to allow you to attach existing Apple adapters to this. So this clamp looks very similar to the black clamp that's on the cable here, but in a much smaller format. Made to fit both the lightning and the 30 pin adapters. So we have the clamp itself, the foam inserts, which allow it to fit the small Apple size cable, and then some slightly shorter screws and nuts. The two tools that are needed for this, we sell as one kit, one part number, T10PD. I'm going to open up the security clamp. Go ahead and insert the foam inserts in it, just a miniature version of the main cable clamp. Make sure nice and level. And your Apple adapters all use relatively the same size cable. So we developed this foam rubber clamp to actually grip this cable without causing any damage or strain on it or changing the electrical characteristics of the product. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to attach this to the Apple clamp, assemble the screw and nut, tighten it down, use the same security screw with the pin driver feature so nobody can actually take this adapter off or steal it. There is a through hole molded into the clamp. I'm going to take my security wire and put it through here. And now I'm ready to reassemble the security wire with the clamp. And use your Allen set screw, an Allen wrench, and tighten that down. Test it, make sure it's nice and firm. Now I can reassemble this clamp on the HDMI cable. All right, there we go. I'm holding the wires to make sure that stays in place. I'll lay my HDMI cable back in. Close the clamp. Tighten down fully when ready. And now I have the HDMI adapter ring with an Apple adapter attached to it. 